Osprey, the largest bird of prey has very spectacular dive skills. Osprey birds are great anglers successful in 1 out of 4 dives for fish. Young Osprey makes their first migration alone, instinctively knowing where to go without following their parents, without using any maps. Osprey birds return not only to their same breeding area each year, but also to their same wintering grounds using their own navigation techniques. The Osprey is a large hawk. Osprey chooses to live their large bodies on water, because their main food is fish. The Osprey is a very large bird of prey they can go up to 2 feet in length from head to tail, and up to 5.5 feet across from wingtip to wingtip. Adults are dark brown above with brownish black marks on the wings and brown speckling on the breast. The head is white with a dark brown crown and brown streak down the cheek, although while in flight you can see a brown wavy pattern under the wing. Osprey feed primarily on livefish, which they catch from the water by using their long, hooked talons. An osprey can plunge so forcefully into the water that, it will completely submerge. When carrying their prey back to the nest, osprey will arrange the fish, so that it is facing upright, head forward. While submerged in water the osprey has heated eyelid like a veil that covers its eyes and allows it to see clearly underwater, just as easily as it goes into the water it then shakes off its feathers much like a wet dog. The osprey carries four claws on each of its feet to clothes. Face forward one claw this backward and the fourth claw, cunt is either forward or backward this allows it to get that perfect grip on its slippery prey. Osprey construct their nests at the tops of dead trees, atop power poles, on man-made nesting platforms, and sometimes on buoys, chimneys, or other structures. The nests are most often used year after year, and can become up to 10 feet high as more nesting materials are added each breeding season. During incubation, the male will defend the nest, and do the hunting, bringing food back to the nest for the female. After fledging, the young remain with their parents for up to two months, and then remain at their wintering grounds for two to three years, until they return north, to make their first attempt at breeding.